Okay, the story of how I became a hypocrite. I had a really long day working from a cafe on Ono Blaze Face Italic at the time, and I was driving home and I was starving because I did that thing where I forgot to eat. And then out of the corner of my eye, at 45 miles an hour, I see a taqueria go by. And I realized that this is how typography has to work. And what am I doing with Ono Blaze Face Italic? It's like, that wouldn't work for hungry people. Another day, I wanted to understand more about my business, so I set up a form for anonymous feedback with three questions. One was, have you bought anything? Two was, what's the best thing? And three, what's the worst thing about Ono? And uh, people seemed to like the foundry, which was good, but they also hated that they didn't have uh, any use for these esoteric, ridiculous typefaces in their projects, like on a day-to-day basis. And I thought, what am I doing again? Uh, I spent a lot of time just thinking of like fun and bizarre typefaces to work on, of course, which is great. And if those don't sell, no problem. Yo, know, I'll just make another. But then when Loretta was born, uh, the time I spent working always means time away from her. It took on a very different meaning to work on these projects. And I had to look at my own library and I just thought, what am I doing? A third time. Then I got really into guitar pedals and uh, all these boutique guitar pedal companies, there's tons of them, and they all make a fuzz pedal. They all make kind of the same stuff in a way, and no one really seems to mind. Everyone's pretty much cool with it. In fact, I got got thinking like maybe there's people that just want to see how Ono would tackle a really familiar genre. So that's basically how Dagular came to be, how I became a hypocrite. It's my take on a very familiar genre. There's seven weights, three optical sizes, there's italics and small caps and all the numbers, and it's got the whole deal. Uh, It's basically my fuzz pedal. Hopefully it's useful. Don't worry, there's more display stuff coming, but in the meantime, I hope you use Dagular over and over and over.